third down. Here's Eckler. Just a one-yard gain on the play, and that'll mean a call to the punt team as it's fourth down. We often talk of situational football. Let's just call it team football. The defense did their job, got off the field, brought the punting situation, so they're turning the ball back over to their offense. You think those guys will get along very well right now? Of course they will. Defense helped the offense. Now it's their turn to take it downfield. A 46-yard boot, but just 36 following a pretty decent return of 10 yards. And it'll be Dolphin football. Getting set to go again on offense. Here's Devontae Parker now. And CD, assuming he stays healthy, assuming the health, should get to that 1,000-yard mark pretty easily. And the best part of what he's done so far is allows him and the team to relax their pursuit a little bit. Meaning, if they just have normal games, they'll get to the 1,000-yard mark. They don't have to force anything. But one of the reasons he's having the year he's having is what I call route running arrogance. They think there's no one that can cover them. No matter how many people are put in, put in his direction, it just doesn't matter. He's going to find a way to beat them. And so far this year, he's done exactly that. He sure has. A draw play now. Melange. Call it a gain of four, and it'll leave him with a third down and six to go. Well, you talked about the need for them to establish the run early. They've been able to do that here in the first half. And that means that the whole offense has adopted that attitude and that persona. We're going to take care of this young quarterback. Let's all get together and run it and take the pressure off. More problems here on third down. They've converted only once so far in this first half. And you know as well as I do in this league, if you don't win on third down, it makes it hard to win a ball game because then you're relying on your defense, you're relying on your special teams. You've got to get it done with your offensive unit. Ready to go with their next drive and at the line, the Cardinal offense. And we're under 20 seconds to go in the half. I'm guessing the wise play here is be safe. That is the wise play because if you think about trying to fool them here, here's what you're facing. You're facing a loosened up secondary, playing a lot deeper than normal. So even if you run some type of misdirection, you're only going to fool him for a second or so. And he can't get rid of it. He's taken down. Kyle Van Noy. Credit him with his sack, and it goes as a loss of six. Protection certainly going to need to be a bit better here on second and six. Due to time constraints, we move you forward in today's broadcast to the beginning of the third quarter. Both teams appear ready for the fight ahead, and we resume action here in quarter number three. And they will not get a chance to return this one as it's through the end zone for a touchback. So here's the Cardinals offense now as they get set to start this third quarter. They're close, close game, but they're going to need to do a little bit better probably here in half two, no? I would agree with that totally. I would guess it in the locker room. They talked about cleaning up some of the errors, but overall, I think they wanted to be positive with them. Guys, we're right there. Just not playing as well as we need to. Let's pick it up, and we still have a chance to win this game. Yeah, they do. We'll see if they can pick it up. Throwing again on second down. Murray, nowhere to escape, and he goes down. Christian Wilkins in there to get him, and on the season now, that is nine sacks for him. Well, that last sack puts Murray and the Cards in a tough spot. Third and long. Murray with a third and long. Sliding out of the pocket. He may try and run for this. And they're going to get this beyond the 40 before he's taken down. That one a broken play, but it ends up being a good play. The scramble goes for 20. After the sack, you could understand it maybe be a little bit nervous back there, a little skittish. He looked awfully decisive when he took off and ran. Very decisive and picked up that from nowhere to escape, and he goes down. Give the sack to Jerome Baker. And plays like that really hurt play calling. They had a really nice gain on the previous play, but gave about half the yardage back on the sack. Excellent pressure up front. Nowhere to go with the football. Down he goes. And he'll get this only up to about the 35. Tough first half for him, unable to put up the numbers he's used to producing. But with a guy like him, you and I both know it just takes a couple of explosive touches for him to make an impact on this game and on the stat sheet as well. That's going to be caught by Kirk. Room to run past midfield. And brought down across the 50 to the 49-yard line. Give him 16 yards there, and it's a Cardinals first down as well. So now first and 10 as they've crossed into Miami territory at the 49-yard line. Throwing now is Murray. 